presenting The Rudy Show with your host, Rudy Bear. And guest for tonight, Jesse J. Hello, everybody, and welcome. You ready, Jesse? Let's do it. Cool. So, first question If you were a dog for a day, what would you do? If I was a dog for the day, I would go swimming and I would just have someone. You know, those, I've got one of those things where you put the ball on the stick and then you flip the thing. Hey, hey, where'd it go? I think that's so much fun. And I'd hang out with loads of other dogs, like you just see us rolling. Me and my bitches. You and your what? <laughs> okay. Okay, second question. What is the worst thing about being a human? The worst thing about being human is... Hmm. Better sit down for this one. I hate being ill. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, getting sick, being, like catching infections and getting ill and diseases and I wish that didn't exist. The world would be a much nicer place. I agree, I agree. So, what's your favorite type of dog? My favorites are Frenchies, because the way they walk and they just use their shoulders. Because I've got a Frenchie, so... He's, you can't even move his shoulders that well, he's so fat. <laughs> you guys hearing this? Yes. Tell me more about the man in your life. Jackson, right? Jackson is... August. 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 He's nearly two years old. His birthday's on the 31st of October. Um, he's grey. Grey blue. Doesn't look anything like you, Rudy. Really. Why? What colour am I? Um, and he's really stupid and really sweet and loves water mm -hmm. and sleeps a lot. Mm -hmm. Doesn't like it when people come near him when he eats. Yeah, and he makes loads of noise. Like a pig dog. Like a pig dog. Did she, did she call him a pig dog? Huh. What's his name again? Well, I named him Jackson because when he was a little puppy, when, he, when I first brought him home, I finished filming The Voice and I drove back from Birmingham or Manchester. Was it Manchester? Yeah, Manchester. And I went and picked him up and he was literally this big. And he was like, and then when we got home, I kept losing him in the flat because he'd just wander around. And uh, he always walked backwards. So I called him Jackson after the great Michael Jackson. That's easy. I can do that too. Look, hey, there we go. Anyway, were you a good mum to Jackson when he was growing up? I was just like really fun, probably not strict enough, especially when it came to food. Mmm, food is um, cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I, I used to play a lot with him and he was really ill a lot when he was a puppy. And there was one time he had projectile diarrhea. Say what? And I woke up and he literally, no joke, I will actually send you the picture to put in this interview. Mm. He had literally like sprayed my whole kitchen with poo. Oh, listen <laughs> to this. I'd never do that. And I've got like metal, um, like chain mails curtains. Uh -huh. So it's like really heavy. It had to be cleaned with a toothbrush because it was just all over it. It was awful. Holy mother of all puppies. So yeah, I'm, I'm, and I didn't have a go at him. I just sat him down and, you know, no, and made him look at it. Oh, poor little Jackson. Speaking of poo, what do you smell like? Uh, I usually smell like um, pomegranate noir, Jo Malone, and Armani diamonds, which I've been wearing for like years, like since I was... 18. I don't know who any of those people are, but I'm going to interview them. Anyway, I heard you have a new album. Any tracks you think I'd like? I think, Rudy, I think your favourite song would be Sweet Talker. Cool. Because you could bark at, at me, sweet talking, barking. Bark it to me. Sweet bark to me, sweet barker, sweet barker. It's got a different vibe, but I quite like it. Excellent. Thanks, Jesse. It was lovely having you on our show tonight, and make sure you say hi to Jackson for me. Yeah.